just as no two unicorns, dragons, or phoenixes are the same. And Shannon, you will never get such good results. From another wizard's wand. Ah, yes, Shannon. A wand of oak. Fifteen inches. Rather bendy. Ah, the core of a unicorn hair. Tell me, which is your wand arm, right or left? Yes. You would, please. Now, Shannon, see my flowers in the corner there? They're looking a bit dry, wouldn't you say? Yes, indeed. I would like you to give them some water. I want you to point your wand at it and say, Argumente. Argumente. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not your want. <laughs> not to worry, you're doing just fine. Just fine. It has always been clear to those of us who have studied wand law. Chooses Tell me, Shannon, when is your birthday? Uh, March 20th. Very good. A wand of willow. Ten and a half inches. Swishy. <laughs> the core of a phoenix tail feather. You would? Now, Shannon, see my ladder right here? I would like you to bring it closer to me, if you would, please, by pointing your wand at it and saying... Accio ladder. Accio ladder. <laughs> Tricky customer, eh, right, Shannon? <laughs> Your wand is here, and we shall find it. Now then. answer your questions and explain your options. Now, Shannon, remember, never store your wand in your back pocket. <laughs> <laughs> Elementary wand safety. It's a pleasure to meet you, Shannon. My pleasure indeed. Off you go. Ladies and gentlemen, I invite you to browse our entire selection of wands in our shop.